Hello guys, how are you? I hope that you all are doing well at your homes and you all are doing fine. So guys, firstly I want to say sorry to you that since so many weeks I have not uploaded any of the video because I was not well. So now I am feeling better and I'm now I am making video for you. So now let's leave this apart and talk about today's video. Where in today's video I will be sharing one Mac OS trick and that trick which is very awesome and if you will use that trick then you will also love your Mac OS. Because Mac OS is a very wide system and in and in Mac OS like there are like so many different type of tips and tricks that I also don't know uh, and like when I and when I discover any new tricks so I make that video for you guys so that you can also be aware so for telling uh, for telling the uh, today's trick you have to watch this full video to know what is a trick so now let's start the video and know which trick I'm going to talk about today so let's start the video Before starting on the video, I would like to make a request to all of you guys that please subscribe my channel and please press the bell icon next to it so that you will be you will be updated and aware with the, all the latest happenings in the Apple world. So if you have done that, let's get started. So the Mac OS trick which I am going to talk about today is that that in Mac OS Monterey or in Mac OS Big Sur or like in any Mac OS, you can change the app icons. Like you know that like all the apps like uh, that we download from the App Store or like from the Google or like from Safari, so like they have their own default app icons. But uh, but like sometimes like we uh, like we are not aware of the app icons or like we cannot distinguish between the apps. So so like for our uh, uh, so like for our comfortness I have brought this video in front of you that you can change the app icons according to you so that like you will be aware that, that which apps means what because I have also tried that and it has made my life very easy because because now I can because now I can identify the apps that which apps I have to use and which apps I don't have to use so if you will also apply this trick uh, in your Mac so you will be also be aware and you will all your life will also become very easy where, where further in this video I have uh, put a, a screen recording of my Mac so that I can show you one tutorial that how you can change the app icons and suppose and suppose in future if you want to if you want to re, uh, revert back all the app icons uh, as a default icon so how you can also do it so now let's move to our mac screen and i will show you how you can make or like how you can change the app icons in your mac top screen and now i will tell you that how you can change the mac os monterey app icons like suppose here are so many apps and suppose if i want to change the icon of any app like i, I don't want like this picture on my app i just want to set my own image so like so that i can know that uh, that this app means this thing so firstly you have to follow some steps which i will show you in this screen recording so please follow those steps properly so firstly like suppose if i go first you have to go in your finder then in finder you will find an option called applications in applications when you will go so you, for random you can select any application like suppose for this video i am going to select the application called powerpoint so in powerpoint when i will select so you have to either press command i or you can just right click and you can click on the option called get info when you click on get info then this type of window will appear in front of you and from here only you have to change the app icon i will show you how so suppose for instance i am going to my downloads and i can select any random picture suppose like i have selected uh, this picture i will show you just the picture so like this picture like it's a wallpaper so suppose if i, if I want that i want this wallpaper as my microsoft powerpoint app icon so i can do that so what you have to do is that you have to click on this picture like this and then you have to drag it to here at the top where microsoft powerpoint option will be there so here like as you can see that there is a plus icon uh, beneath my mouse so like when you will drop that image over there so it will ask you uh, to allow some changes so here you have to put your password so here when i put my password i have to click on ok so now as you can see that the microsoft powerpoint icon has been changed so now when i will close from here and when i will go in my so like when i have gone in my launchpad so here you can see that the icon has been changed on microsoft powerpoint right so um, now you so in this way like you can change the app icon of any like you can change icon of any apps in the mac os and suppose if you want to revert back to original icon so how you can do it i will also tell you that so again we have to go on finder and then we have to go then we have to go on the applications folder and then we have to select again microsoft powerpoint and now when i click on microsoft powerpoint so you have to again you have to click on right click or you can click on get info or you can 
uh, use a option called command plus i so here we put get info and now here as you can see the picture is here if you want to delete this you can't delete it from here you have to click on this picture and in your map keyboard you have to press a delete key so when I click the delete key so it will again you will it will ask you to put your password so you have to put your password and then you will click okay so as you can see the app icon has been reverted back to its original so in this way you can change the app icons in the mac os it's a very tricky thing in the mac os and, and i think so i thought that i should share with you these tips so that like you can be updated with these type of tips so guys this is all for this video and I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed this video then don't forget to like this video, share this video and subscribe to my channel and don't forget to mention me in, in the comment section below that how you like this trick and if you like this trick I will bring more similar videos related to it. So for now guys it's over. Bye. I will meet you next week. Bye bye guys. Take care.